James here with a quick unboxing and showcase of a new product. This is from Enjoy Basics, guys. This is their 16 by 20 photo frame. This is matted down to 11 by 14. So you can put 11 by 14 photo in it, or you could take the mat out and use the whole picture frame for a 16 by 20 picture, which is very cool. Now, they do come in several sizes, 16 by 20, 11 by 14, 11 by 17, 12 by 16, 12 by 18, and 13 by 19. It comes in a couple colors. It comes in white or black, guys, or a wood frame style, which is very, very cool. Now, this frame is just like a wall hanger. We're going to open it up, try to give you first looks of this, guys. So if you guys bear with me, we'll kind of cut this open, and hopefully we can cut it open. My uh, knife is getting really dull. I mean, really dull. So trying to do this and actually it's nice and bubble wrapped guys so if you guys see it's just the basic box showing what it is two pieces so you get two frames on the back it shows you the size material plastic plexiglass and synthetic wood and insulations very simple very easy nothing to worry about with the packaging i love that they bubble wrapped it inside this nice and tight so you guys will see this as i see this you guys see it nice bubble wrapped back to back so the out the back sides are showing to keep the glass safe. Now I'm gonna try and unwrap this, but it's taped again. You guys need to remind me, pick up a new box opener. So inside here is wall hangers, guys. These are kind of cool. So I don't know if you guys have ever seen one of these, but you don't need nails. It's like a four pin style nail in it and it becomes the hanger. These are very cool. Hopefully you guys can kind of see this. Yeah. It's kind of hard to see with the glare of the, the lighting, but it's a wall hanger. They give you three of those just in case one doesn't work. You got two more. They show you that you will need a hammer to do it, guys. Make sure you set it up, how to rotate it, take it apart and put a photo in it. Um, Inside the bubble wrap, you actually have these two frames. If you guys can see this, they have the Statue of Liberty in it, and they are big frames. These are very, very nice. Now you guys can see the reflection of my light, but nice looking frames, very decent. I like the black on white with the mat, so that is very cool. We're going to try and wrap, unwrap this, guys, without burnt it too much back to the trusty little pocket knife that should be good enough got a little hole here guys unwrap it of course we got some corner edge pieces that keep the corner safe now we'll actually put a photo in this so you guys can see this now we're going to show you guys something else you guys see this? This is actually plastic wrapped again, so you got to take the plastic off of the front. Remember to please peel the protective coating. So we will do that also once we pull it apart. To pull it apart, you have three clips per long side plus two clips per short side. You just turn them. You just basically turn them so they unlatch, you know, push down. So if you push down a little and then turn like that, it unlatches. All the way around you have two ways to hang this landscape mode or portrait mode guys so you have two ways to do it I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do this off camera we're gonna slide this off and then I'll come back to camera once it's apart and show you guys how to peel the plastic and put a photo in it okay guys now that we got it apart you guys see I have this off we're gonna set that aside we have the picture frame you need to pull the plastic that was in this the little photo out guys right once that out we'll set it down inside here is the matting slip the matting out guys just like this be careful with it you will need it then inside you have this piece of plastic plexi now you are going to have to peel the plastic off the edge which is a protective plastic now this may be a trick. Peeling it, you just gotta find the right piece. Just like that, guys. 
And it's going to be on both sides, unfortunately. So they do protect it pretty well. It's it's plex it's plexi. So you guys just remember, plexi will scratch just like glass. Once it's done, it's nice and see through. Now we grab the frame, just like we just had. Put grab the frame, set the plexi back in, just like that, guys. And now we're gonna reverse all this. The matting, same thing. Put the add in. Now we have the matting back. Now. If you don't have 11 by 16 photo, so by luck, I have art, my kid's art. So we're going to throw my kid's art in there and try to make it look very, very elegant. Just like that, guys, we have art. So I'm going to set this down and I'm going to reverse clip in all of these pieces. So we grab this, make sure whatever direction you're hanging it in, guys, that you have the hangers in the proper direction. Slide this in just like this. Grab the frame and I'll kind of I'll kind of show you guys this or walk you through this. Slide it, push it, and it clips in. Slide it, push it, clips in. Same with every edge. Just make sure you push it down and it clips in. I love this pushing clip in system because the old styles could always break off. And if you guys know what I mean, they, the old ones just broke off on all, a lot of picture frames. So this is a very cool system that it clips into a little lip and we're good to go. Now, if you guys can see, that actually looks really, really nice. So that is very, very cool, very nice picture frame. Unfortunately, the picture just slid because I don't have it in tight enough. But we will readjust that as we go. I am banging this around. So just make sure it's in there nice and tight, guys. You may have to, if your picture slides a little, you may have to, you know, tape it to the batting or something. But that is the Enjoy Basic 16 by 20 picture frame set. Guys, remember this is a two-piece kit, 16 by 20 frame, uh, 11 by 14 mat. If you don't want the mat, you can fill this up with the full picture. Thanks for checking out this video, guys, and have a great day.